Hi everyone, Hoodie here. And um, today is Sunday. And uh, today has been a <sighs> crazy day. I say that a lot, don't I? I'm trying to make sure to get my eyes. It looks like I got black eyes, so I had to hold it out to here. So, um, my house is a biohazard zone right now. No, it's not Ebola. It's not the zombie virus. She has the foot, hand, mouth disease thing. Um, both my wife and my son. Um, more of my wife, she caught it, I guess, from the baby. <clears throat> and uh, so both of them are sick and it's very contagious. So I'm just trying to make sure I don't kiss on her or to be too close to her. Um, which is hard uh, for me. Um, and, uh, and of course, not being close to my baby boy. Um, so that's, that's rough. What it does is it causes um, blisters to form on her feet and on her hands and on, around her mouth. And, um, and hopefully, you know, they go away quickly. And, but even then, they said it's probably... I think she said 10 days after the signs of the virus go away. Um, so anyway, um, on the brighter side, um, went to Walmart and uh, they had lots of uh, clearance stuff, 90% off. So got a uh, lots of like a uh, um, color hairspray, uh, which of course I need a lot because, you know, I have so much hair. Hair needs some color. Mm -hmm. That's a power beard there. Right there. Mm -hmm. Yep. Power. Power. So uh, I'm just uh, resting up, reading some comics. And uh, I'm not going to do a very long video. <laughs> Face is not already funny looking. So, I'm going to go ahead and uh, read some and uh, let you guys go. And, um, oh yeah, that happened today. <clears throat> I had a bout of depression for a little while. Um, I in here. Uh, and it's kind of from the social media part of it and kind of not um the thought crossed my mind that if i were to not be on social media at all who would notice i understand that a lot of people if i put that question on facebook or on twitter or whatever other google plus whatever i would get lots of people to that fly just landed on my big old head. Lots of people to say, yes, we miss you. Yes, we we love you. We want you around. Things of that sort. And yet, when I had this, uh, my uh, other two Facebooks had um, got shut down, um, very few people even contacted me. I had to contact them to let them know, hey, I need your contact information. And I understand people are busy. I understand that life goes on and it's and, and you're in the midst of your life stuff. But taking the minute to say, you know what, if we're friends, and then this goes for me too, I should reach out more. And, and I feel like I, I reach out a, a lot I'm just wondering, you know, I just totally went off grid. Who would even notice? I really don't have the answer for that. <laughs> it's it just kind of out there that <clears throat> we have gotten so much intertwined with our social media that 
it becomes our lifeblood. It becomes, I mean, people have died over Facebook stuff, over social media stuff. And it makes me want to not be a part of that. You know, it's, we, we rely upon it so much that if I'm not able to contact you via Facebook or email, then I just don't have a way to contact you. And if you're my friend and I'm your friend, we should be able to contact one another. Here's another thought. How many of us really know where one another lives? If for some reason we had a big terrorist attack and they zapped all of our electricity, where to go? Would you know how to find your friends? Probably went shopping for groceries and stuff like that, and she forgot her phone. And it was about almost 11, 12, to, you know, one, two, almost like three hours um, until she came back home. She did a lot of shopping and things like that. But if without a cell phone and me with no vehicle, um, I would have no way of finding out where she went, what she did. She was in an accident. Now I'm sure I'd be able to get a phone call from one of her phone, but um, yeah. So let's just say this, and then of course I've gone longer than my regular video. <clears throat> Let me say this. I want to encourage anybody that watches this to make real life connections if you can. Reach out to those, meet them in person, get to know your friends. Because we may not have these technologies. I mean, I know technology is increasing all the time, but, you know, some things happen. So, why not get real and uh, get connected with your friends? And uh, thanks for watching. So, see. Bye, bye, bye. I'm going to make that. I'm going to do that for a little while. There you go. Ooh.